Hello and welcome to Gaming Cipher. I am Stephen Reyes and today we will be taking a look at Dead Man's Diary. Dead Man's Diary is created by TML Studios and quite frankly they do a fantastic job with this game that this game has a mixture of amazing features to experience that the w open world that you get to explore is vast and definitely creepy at times which is kind of perfect for a post-apocalyptic survival game with this game you're kind of just thrown right in the middle of a forest after you've been ejected from the bunker of the few survivors that are left because there's not enough supplies so you've been left to fend for yourself so you're going to scavenge around Who's there? forests, abandoned complexes, traveling across this vast terrain. And if you think just wandering around is complex, know that you have to literally scavenge and check every nook and cranny to find supplies to survive. You're going to have to pick and choose what items you want to craft because your materials are scarce. So you can't make everything. Sometimes you have to like be very vigilant as to what you are crafting to make sure it's going to help you last just a little bit longer that the world is amazing to look at whether it's at night or during the day day is a little bit easier to get around trust me it's a little less creepy and the sound design is fantastic that it has some creepy sounds that will get you jumping out of your boots that you will be wandering as you traverse this immense game it has 27 action-packed levels to explore this is a fantastic survival game that will provide you with, with tons and tons of game time for exploring and enjoyment i will give this game an 8 out of 10 if you love wandering so around a scary apocalyptic world and possibly having your heart jump first. out of your chest i highly recommend this thank you for watching i'm stephen reyes with gaming cypher